the ability to instantly switch back and forth from up weighting to down weighting and grounding effects is a tremendous advantage in movement performance. However, it is also a technique in the arts for communication and creative effects. This applied science broadens the repertoire of one's personal techniques. An easy way of illustrating the effects of the center on our body is if you just pick up a belt or a piece of rope or something and you grab it with your palms facing down and then take one hand and pull against the other hand and use your index finger to pull like this you can feel this upper body muscles tightening as you pull and you know you can get a nice firm rigid pull to that motion but you'll notice if you keep pulling it starts to fatigue because you're contracting those muscles so this is sort of like chest breathing too right? in a sense but now what we're going to do is we're just going to take the, the, the belt and we're going to hold it from underneath and then grab and now we're using the little finger And now we're going to hold tightly with the little finger. Keep in mind the other grip was with the index finger. And now as we pull, you're going to feel the tension go down the lower arm into the chest and stomach. So there's two different muscle groups. There's the caped upper and outer muscles. And there's also the chest, lower arm, and abdominal muscles. So naturally, if it's going to the abdomen, it's going to the center. So if we tighten the grip by using that in-breath expansion energy, you can feel that the work and the connection is from the center. And you also feel that your shoulder and neck relax because they're not, those muscles aren't being used. What's also interesting is that if we have this little finger grip, as we tighten the grip, you feel your feet lift up a little bit. You can feel the feet go up the slightest bit. And that's what we call unweighting or upweighting, the energy vector there is going this way. It's going as we pull up, as we pull back, it's going up. And that inhale expansion is also lifting us up slightly, but that slightest amount makes a big difference when we look at our gifted performance movement is that slight bit of unweighting makes the movement faster. It also makes it more controllable. And that slight un unweighting also helps in the balance and flexibility. So let's go back and do the palms down. So we do the palms down, we're grabbing with the index finger again and pulling And you'll notice your feet are settling into the ground a little bit. And that's because we're creating a downward vector. So if we're doing a movement where we want to move quicker, we don't want to do this movement because it makes our feet drag, it makes our body heavy. But if we want to do a movement where we need to be stable and grounded, 
then we use this, this type of grip. So understanding the dynamics of the center then helps us to increase our biodynamics in all our movements by picking and choosing what do I need to be grounded or do I need to be lifted up a little bit. So again, moving from the center gives us those options of literally using the other half of our biodynamics. We have grounded and we have up weighting that we can pick and choose from.